Let's get right into it. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Bad Parenting. Number one, Mr. Mr. Redface. You can't see the fucking screen. Oh, I'm... 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 What? No, that, that's... That's it. Am I not... Hmm? But... but. Hoo-ah! Hey, hey. Let's try that again. Hello, everybody. Welcome to... Bad parenting number one, Mr. Redface. Pretend you didn't see that. <laughs> Fuck. Um. <coughs> Anyways, let's get into it. <laughs> Catchy. Oh! Shred. The door's dancing. Oh. Uh. Alright, I don't like this as much. Still shredding them. Oh, I love this type of music. I love this type of music. Do not do that to me. Mom, you're home late again. With your very oval eyes. Come on. I was busy with work. Yeah. Can you have some sympathy for me? If if by work, you mean banging Tyrone the neighbor? Oh, you don't think I hear you from across the street? You know, doing your thing with Tyrone? So loud, the neighbor's neighbors could hear it. Alright? And, and, and across the street is Billy. And I go to school with him. And every time I go to school, he goes, Yo, it's that kid who's... Mom is getting banged by Tyrone, and then everybody laughs at me. How do you how do you think I feel, Mom? How do you think I feel? <laughs> uh, yeah. But today is my birthday, and it's my birthday. Uh, oh, of course, I know that. No, you didn't, because you you unfortunately you know bang Tyrone. <laughs> then where's my get okay i would never ask that maybe i would to my own mom like in a sarcastic way though not actually <laughs> expecting a gift but if she forgot i'd be like yeah i might call her out on it <laughs> have you ever heard of mr redface <laughs> yeah it's the title of this game So if this Mr. Redface secretly leaves gifts on good kids when they sleep, why haven't I ever seen him before? Are you saying oh, I'm not a good kid? Unless I'm one years old, in which case that makes plenty of sense. She's going back to Tyrone's place. I fucking oh, I look sick. Okay. You're fooling the kid again. Yeah, I'm with dad. Dad, I swear, I, I didn't know you were behind me. I wouldn't have said all that stuff about Tyrone. How many times have you come home this late? <laughs> Bullshit. Say, I did not mean for you to hear that, Dad. <clears throat> oh, God. Okay, I did not mean to catch a stray by you. But, you know, you look a lot better than Mom does. Oh, let's say that. You freak me out less. I think you look a little cool. Like a little cool design. <laughs> Eavesdrop. I started this conversation. Oh. I started this conversation. Oh. Oh, never mind. I think you freak me out more than mom. Mom. Oh, God. Oh, God. I am mother. I am father. Anyways, how did he? Oh, I can run too. Running in the halls, running in the hall. Oh, fuck, running in the halls, running in the halls, running in the kitchen. Yeah, we ball. Yeah, let's get this done. Can't open that door. Oh yeah. I'm going in this room. <gasps> you can't close doors behind me. Is this my room? Yeah, that's definitely my room. Look, I got a little table. Mom and Dad, why do you guys have separate beds? Billy says, 
Mom and Tyrone have the same bed. Fuck. God damn. I just go to bed crying. Crying. See if we can explore around. I do not like that door's closed behind me. Hope Mr. Redface gives me a new mom and dad so that I can go to school and not be bull. Okay, I'm done with that. I cannot. I cannot keep this up. I cannot. My phone go berber. Fuck! Listen, man, I had water in my goddamn in my mouth. Oh. Oh no. Mr. Redface? Here to leave me gifts? Oh no, no, no. no. I, I, I missed opportunity completely. I could. Okay, never mind. It was Mr. Redface. Hit the hood! I'm epileptic! I'm epileptic! Do not do this! I'm not actually epileptic. I just say anything to get this fucking... Not the closet. <clears throat> Gee, another day, another... Another, I hope there's nobody in my closet type morning. Good thing... Um... Good thing. Uh, uh, it's a plant. <laughs> oh. Oh, it's it's beautiful. Just what I always wanted. Oh, it talks. Hi, Ron. Hi, Ron. Of course, because I was created by magic. You are, you are mag magical. You even have the same name and appearance as me. Down right to those stitch eyes and mouth. I don't like this. My master made me just for you. Oh, your neck's a little loose. Yeah, you, you're looking at me like you're confused. Oh. What does that mean, Ron? Best friends, yes. I've always wanted a best friend that looks just like me, but with a crooked neck. Do you want to play something with me, Ron the doll? Ron too? What? What should I? If we're both named Ron. I stored my toys in the closet. Can you get them for me? Ron, I don't mean to freak you out, but the guy who brought you here went into that closet. Oh, God. Closet's still suck. Can you try that again? Ron, I think if I do that again, my dad might come in here. And he, he does not like it when I bang the closet. Do you want me to do something else? I tried my best. I'm hungry, Ron. I'm hungry. You're you're a doll. Can you can you even eat? No. You'll be the one eating, but I'll be able to feel everything you eat. At least you're not a doll of my mom. <laughs> I don't think Tyrone tastes that great. Oh God. My master linked all your senses and emotions to me, so I can easily understand you. Oh, that's nice. Wow, that's amazing. Thanks, Ron, too. Time to go see my dad, I think. Oh, no. I'm... Mm. Telephone. Alright. I hunger for this note. You're reading this letter at 1 p.m., aren't you, sleepyhead? I prepared your favorite dish in the fridge, so remember to heat it up before eating. Lately, I've noticed you've been getting lazy about eating. You know I don't have much time at home, so please learn to take care of yourself and stop making me worry. 
One more thing. Don't forget to take your medicine after eating. Mom. Thanks, Mom. I'm holding something out. Well, where the fuck do I put you, Ron? Oh. Don't stand, Ron. Sit. We do not stand on furniture. God, who fucking raised you? It wasn't me. I did not raise you like that. I swear to God, if you close, automatically fridge gods one more time. <clears throat> I'll be pissed. Microwave or stove? You're right. I'd probably blow this place up. I don't like the way you're looking at that. That bottle of boot. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm not. Is that your favorite dish? Do you want to see me perform some magic? The fuck you mean, Ron? Yes, please! Alright. I'll make this plate of food never run out. Every time you finish eating, the dish will be restored to its original state. Are you trying to make me fat, Ron, too? Oh, that sounded that. Wow, that's amazing. What else can you do? Guys, I just realized something. Sun backwards is NOS, which has nothing to do with anything. I just thought I'd say that that's a thing. And Ron backwards is I told you he was an alcoholic. I told you he was an alcoholic. That's going to be really bad. Do not drop that. He's an alcoholic. He's an alcoholic. Dude. Oh! <laughs> My reaction too. What just the what the what the what the what the what the just happened. I I I don't know. You guess. I bet you fucking know, Ron. I bet you. Oh no, the bottle. My dad's gonna whoop my ass. I told you not to play with daddy's liquor. Fun juice. He calls it fun juice. I hope he's still asleep. Watch. It's gonna. No, no. This is my image in my head. It's gonna pan to the spaghetti. Take another bite. And then I hear, like, breathing in my nose. I'm going to turn around, and Dad's going to be right fucking there. And belt in hand. I'm about to get my ass whooped. Don't worry. My master is taking your dad away. The fuck you mean, Ron 2? What do you mean by that? What did you say? Alright, no. That's not there. Hi. I need to take my medicine. Please, God, let me take my medicine. Make, make. I swear, my dad's in that fucking spaghetti run too. We're gonna have problems. Lots of damn problems. Nothing else in the damn fridge. That was dad. We're gonna have, have problems. Keeping my eyes on you. What the f- no, mm -mm. no! No! How are you two places at once? Ron two. God damn it, explain yourself. Hi, Ron. Where's my dad? Don't tell me Tyrone got him too. <laughs> I. Uh I can't handle another parent banging Tyrone. That's what my master is taking your dad away. I swear the fuck if he's in my closet. Is he in this closet? Because your dad's a bad person. He did call me a little shit yesterday. He often hits and yells at you. Hits! Yeah, yeah, he sounds like a pretty bad guy. He sounds like a pretty bad guy. You're taken away by my master to protect children like you. Your master sounds like a like a pretty good dude. Like a pretty damn good dude. My dad doesn't deserve that. Um, well, if he hits and yells at me, it kind of sounds like he does. He is a bad person. No, he's not, Ron 2. Please, let my dad go. 
I'm begging you. All right, all right. But my master won't like this. It's quite a long way to where your dad is being held. You'll have to use a shortcut if you want to get there in time to save him. Show me the way. The shortcut is through your closet. But isn't my closet stuck? What about my dad's closet? Or my mom's closet. I don't know which bed is which. Oh, well, I guess this is dad's bed. What is on dad's bed? Radio. Mom has makeup, perfume. Huh, man, sucks to be them. Oh, so now, now you're gone from here. The fuck, Ron, too? Alright, this is a weird house layout, by the way. Man, I think it's nice that... Still can't open it? That's disappointing. I guess I'll have to use your parents' closet then. Can I eat more spaghetti? Why is your light? Uh, these closets can function as portals. I can take you anywhere you want, including where your dad is being held. Give it a try. Um, I want to go to McDonald's. Oh. Oh, okay. A few steps. Bring your dad's radio and place it in front of the closet. This radio will work like an elevator, but you need to select the frequency first. You choose the right frequency, the door will open to the place you need to go. Oh my fucking god. Hi. Hi. The fuck, Ron, too? The fuck was that thing? The fuck was that thing, Ron, too? Hmm. Is that right? This, 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 this one. Ron, too, you better not be deceiving me. Alright. Jeez. Campfire. And closet. Hmm. All right. <gasps> uh, um, <clears throat> anyways, this is where Mom and Tyrone told me to wait outside. Oh, what the fuck is that? Is that my dad? You're so blur. I tried. Squ Catman. How did I miss you the first time I came by? Hey there. So, I'm looking for my dad. Described. My dad's name is Bruce. His name is Bruce? God damn. Wait a moment. Not that there's anything wrong with being named Bruce. There are many Bruce's here. Any more details? See, lots of people are named Bruce that go missing in interdimensional closets. Is this Bruce a good Bruce or a Brad Bruce? I don't know. If I'm being honest, he's a piece of shit Bruce, you know? Dad is the kind of person who gets a bit angry. Hits, yells. So he's a bad Bruce. Is there only one bad Bruce? Oh. Never mind. Maybe there is something being wrong with wrong with them being named Bruce. What else does he do? Yells. Oh, but there's only one Bruce who domestically abuses his son, so maybe, maybe not all Bruce's are that bad. <laughs> uh, the fuck that sent chills down my spine. Boo. Haha. <laughs> you just got start. Yeah, the fuck I did. Why are you in the trunk? How did you come out of the fire? <laughs> who are you guys? Just like you, we're kids on our way to find our parents. We're staying here for a bit. 
Do you want to join us? Nah. Yeah, I'm in a hurry. See you later. Yeah, fuck you, dude. I hit puberty, young boy. Go on now. I must journey to see Papa. <laughs> Dad? Gulp? Dad? Why do you look like that? Why are there so many checkers? Please stop punishing me. Well, no, now you know not to hit kids. It's me, Dad. Your son. It's been two days. Enough time for me to become a man. Please stop punishing me. Father, I require your assistance. I'm here to grab you and take you away. Ron too stole your wine, aka fun juice. What, what, what has he done to you, Papa? Come on, let's go home, or Mr. Redface will take both of us. Please stop. Pun okay, now you're sounding like a fucking broken record. Now, you know what? Oh, I guess. What? What do I gotta push you out of bed? The hell do I need to do? Is there something else? Spell. <laughs> no, wait, now I'm Ron too. Maybe? Was that me in the closet? Oh, hey, Mom. Dad, Dad got kidnapped. Do not. Do not. Okay. Nope, stop. Stop. <laughs> Is your neck feeling okay? How bad did Tyrone break it? How? What? What? What is wrong with you? Me? You're the one with the crooked neck. Why are you hiding in the closet? Mr. Redface has taken Dad. Oh. Well, that's a good thing then. M Mom? Uh, I'm not joking. It's a long story. Let me explain. How's your doll Ron doing today? Is it alright? The doll? Huh, how do you know about it? Of course I know, since you haven't taken your medicine today. Oh. This isn't the first time you've had such hallucinations. Huh, come on. Every time you tell a different story, the common factor is always that stupid doll. Don't you remember that previous times? No. Oh, oh, same you. <sighs> I don't know what is wrong with you. Just go to bed. It's midnight already. Mom, it sounds like... What the hell? What the hell? Why are you built like that? Dang, Mom. You know what? I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go... Ron and I are gonna take all the pills. And then prove to you that Ron's real. Ron. Then give me my pills. I'm gonna go take all my pills. Ron! God damn it, can you take my my meds? Mom? Did you hear the sound of a body thumping on the ground? <sighs> Anyways, I have to pursue my educational prowess. Yo, 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 run! What's up, my duck? Mom! Mom! Ron's floating in my room. Ron's? Fucking dumbass. Love you. Fucking bitch. Ron! <laughs> Hey, Mr. Redface, how are you doing today? Mom. What, what just happened, son? Mother, it appears that Mr. Redface did not like me going to see Papa. Ron was floating. 
And then I was floating. <laughs> Are you alright? No. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> Obviously. Oh my god, do not look at me like that. Do you feel better now? No, you're creeping me out. Oh, am I? That's bad. Yeah, Mom. It's Mr. Redfin. It's alright. Tomorrow I'll take a day off to stay home and take care of you. Thanks, Mom. Really? Promise me, Mom? I promise. Now go back to sleep. Yes, Mom. Mom doesn't know that the cure to seeing Mr. Redface is popping open a cold Pepsi. <laughs> Woohoo! Mom? Don't worry, son. We got Pepsi. Of the cherry variety. Bonk! You've broken the promise again. I'm gonna go see Ron. Nothing bad has ever happened from looking at Ron. Ronnie. Hey, Ron. Oh, you don't look too good. <gasps> oh, no. Ron. What? Mr. Redface beat you up. My master beat the shit out of me. Oh, I'm sorry, Ron. He wasn't happy about what happened yesterday. This is my fault, Ron. I should have never went to see Dad. By the way, have you seen my mom anywhere? My master has taken her away. The fuck she has? <laughs> my reaction when my mom gets taken by Redface. What? It just happened. I'm sorry I couldn't stop him. You're a little fucking dumb. You should run away because he'll come back soon to take you too. No, I have to save my mom. And my dad, I, I guess. <laughs> He's there, too. He hits me. <laughs> Ow, don't, don't you see what he did to me? Spell. Oh. Found this at my dad's prison. Prison? I think it might... Oh, yeah. The red face prison, not <laughs> my dad's a convict. I think I might help us defeat him. That's a that's a spell to defeat Mr. Redface. Come on, quickly, go into the closet and find where your mom is being held. What the fuck you mean? Yeah. Oh, no, sorry. Dad's closet. First, I want to go eat some spaghetti. We're taking my medicine. Both are important. I cannot eat spaghetti. The fuck you mean I can't eat spaghetti? Huh? Gotta grab dad's radio. Oh, I guess not. Oh, one's already there. No need to do that again. Great, I didn't want to see what was ever on part two again. Cat? No? Boo! Fuck is outside. Hey, Ron, too. <laughs> Flashbang! Why do you look like that? Why? You're being. Get back. Oh yeah. I killed a man with my bare hands. <laughs> Yippee. <laughs> Not really. Hey Ron, how's it going? Can I? Ron? Ron? Um. Do I, do I leave now? You guys aren't telling a very convincing uh, argument not to go now. Hopefully I didn't just piss him off or like I was a strength spell or like why was that left just in the prison? Yep. Oh my fucking god, Ron two. 
What's happening to you? My master has been defeated. The magic has cast me is also fading. Are you disappearing? Don't worry. This is what I wanted. You should go outside and see your parents. Oh my fucking god, I cured my illness. Apparently. Mama, pa. Oh, what the fuck you look like that for? Dad, Mom. Y'all are free now. Ah! You've been having an affair, haven't you? I told you I was busy with work. Liar! Man, I wanna... You motherfucker, I just saved you. You neglected this family for another man. Aren't you ashamed to lie to your son? And what about you? Do you think you're better than me? You're just at home leeching off me all year round. What kind of father are you? Oh my god. No matter what I do, it's my business. And I still bring money home to support my child. And if you still think I'm a whore, you're lowering yourself even below that. God fucking damn it. One more word. Dude, call the cops. Nine, there's a phone back there? Fine, you and I will get a divorce. One of us will have to move out of this house. If you're still here tomorrow, I'll take my son and leave. You stay right there. I'm going back to see Mr. Redface. Please, 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 please. Ron! Ron 2! This is when I need you most. Can I call the cops? Hey, Dad. Get a share of share of Brewski? Dude. Oh, no. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Break. To Mr. Redfaces. Dad, when he's drunk. Oh my god. I won't let this happen. This can't be true. I'm very sorry, Ron. Your closet. I think you're able to open it now. This is me. Why, why don't I know anything about these? You've always known. Because I'm the knowing part of you. 
You've tried to deny and reject these things that made up stories to make yourself feel better about you and your dad. And me? I have to find a way to lead you back into the reality. I've tried many times, many ways to help you accept this truth as easily as possible. And every time I fail, guess what happens? Tick tock boom, all the memories disappear. You once again wake up at the starting point, which is the night your dad murdered you. How long have I been dead? 14 days. It can't have been that long. What really happened to my parents? As for your dad, he's hiding in a cheap motel room. Go home with me, Dad. Oh, my God. What about my mom? She still sees me, doesn't she? That's right. Because she's only home late at night. But if it's daytime... Son? Oh no. about your husband's hiding place. <laughs> you just dropped something, man. What is that? It's a motel car. But I'm not sure it's mine. Stuffed in the trunk of a car, stuck in a closet. Expecting that ending. 
I, I originally I thought it was just like a cool adventure, right? Like, you know, it's it's fun. But not fun. Of course, it's horrifying. There's a red man and stuff like that. But I thought it would actually like I, I took it a little, a lot, way too literally, and didn't really make the connections, which is rare for me. I feel like usually I'm really good about being like, oh fuck, the red man's my dad when he's drunk. That's why the alcohol thing. Oh man. That was a great game. I love the style. Um, con content warning. It got really heavy really quick. I honestly... I mean... Dang. Dang. I don't have a lot to say on, on the subject. Other than... Wow. Wow. That was, a, that was definitely a game. Fuck, <laughs> dude. Oh man, I got I gotta live with that one now. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys. Thank you guys for watching. And for some reason, that doesn't feel right to say. So, I guess I'm just gonna say goodbye. Shit. Bye.